world's bougiest Ralph Lauren store, mate. We're going in. That is La Rosie College, the world's most expensive school. There's a place here in Switzerland, they call it the playground of the billionaires. The world elites go there often to have meetings with each other. They book out some big hotel in the middle of this little ski resort, this little snow town up in the mountains here. And this runs back a long time. Kings and queens, princes, princesses have all taken their holidays here. There's something about this little town, Stadt or Gustad, that's attracting all of these people. And it makes it one of the most richest places on earth, not just that, but it's given it the name, the playground of the billionaires. Like, I'm very interested. So look, I'm in Geneva. I'm in Geneva, Switzerland. We're at the front of Geneva station. I wanna go there. Let's go. What makes it so special? Why do the world leaders and powerful, influential people go there? Why not somewhere else? Why do they have their secret meetings there? What makes it one of the most expensive, richest places? Like, <laughs> let's go find out, mate. So if from here, it's two trains. It just started snowing, so this is gonna be mad. We're gonna catch a train along Lake Geneva to a place called Montreux. Once we're in Montreux, we're catching an old school, like cottage type of train. I've seen a picture of it. Zigzagging up the mountains to start. But mate, we're just rocking up, me and you, unannounced. They don't know we're coming. They're probably gonna chase us out, like, get out of here, you scumbag. <laughs> and let's just creep around and see what it's about. See the shops, suss out the motel, see what the food's like, and just generally just try to get an idea of what's going on. <sighs> I'm so glad it started snowing. As soon as I left the motel this morning, it started snowing, it just adds to the vibe. I'm thinking I'm going to some snow resort for the billionaires. It better snow, you know what I mean? <laughs> Get there and it's all dry. I really genuinely want to know what's going on here. Like I've researched it a lot and it's just been the spot. But when I research it, I try and like research like what, what has attracted these people to here or what has made this the place and I can't get a straight answer. It may not be evident. We may get there and we, we may have no idea why. We could get off the train and know exactly why it could be. Hey, mate, I know what you's are doing here, mate. Oh, hey, baby, say less, mate. Fucking hey, I'm on to use, mate. You know what I mean? All right, brother. Just following everyone upstairs. Don't mind if I do. Just tag along like I'm one of the oi bays. They're looking at me like, what's this bloke talking to an Amrake? But it doesn't matter. Finally, oh lad, this is beautiful. Look at this. Bro, we're under the big snowy mountains now. Look at that, bros. It's like a castle up on the up on the hill there. Yeah, we're only at the train station, Span. We're only halfway to, to start, good start. <laughs> Still, bro, this is crazy. That journey had the most beautiful view. You've seen it. Getting around that lake, wow, it's an hour and 10 minutes to the other side. That was a pretty fast train as well. 12.35, good start. There we go. What's the time now? 12.33. We got two minutes. I'm not gonna lie, I secretly wanted to go toilet quickly, but we can't miss the train. <laughs> the Golden Pass. From here, Montreux, start goes all the way to Interlaken and Lucerne. I feel like this train line goes like right through the heart of Switzerland. I think that's probably why they call it the Golden Pass. So right from this side, like Geneva, right over to that Interlaken, sort of near Zurich side, like right through the middle of the mountains, all the major towns along the way. 
hate how it does that. Flashing letters, mate. I'm trying to show you. It says start, mate. Oh. Let's hoge. Oh. There's a toilet. Oh. Thank God, but I'll hurry up. Get the train moving, lad, before I bust the doors down. Alright, bro, let's get a warm in here, lad. Taking the accessories off until we get there. The snow accessories. It stopped snowing too, by the way. I'm a little bit sad about that, I'm not gonna lie. Bro, this is sick. We just went in some type of cave, lad. Bro, this is the nicest train that I've ever been in. Get my little laptop out. Yeah, it's fine, yeah, no, yeah, it's fine, yes. On the way to the billionaire's playground, yes. Oh, bruh. We're on the right side. We're on the, we picked the right side, man. <laughs> Finally, we're actually getting into the mountains, lad. Look here, yeah, snow starting to form on the floor. We're in it. We're in amongst it. see down in little gaps we're like halfway up a massive mountain the whole thing is just covered in snow and I'm back down there at the train station worrying about it stopped snowing but the whole thing snowed out look thank you thank you you know what I was sussing out to bro we got ages to go I just looked at the map look at this so we got on here, at the bottom, at that Montreux. Look at that. Oh, I'm all the way. I'm there, cuz. We're, like, we're, we're gone like 10% of the journey. <laughs> Here we are, lad. <laughs> oh, bro, almost died straight away. Wow. That's full ice. That's not even snow. Anyway, back to the topic at hand. Here we are, bro, in Gustav. Wow, bro. What a trip up. That was crazy. You know, I was looking up some stuff on the phone uh, in uh, during that trip. There's a famous motel. You can spot it. It hangs right in the middle of the town. It's called um, Gustav Palace. That's where all the elites go and meet once a year. I also found out that this place has the most expensive school in the world, Le Rosé. But that changes first and second position with another school in Switzerland. But the top two are always here in Switzerland. It's always in the top two. It's uh, 130,000 francs a year. So about a quarter of a million dollars a year. Look at the buildings, bro. They're just straight pine. <laughs> They're just like straight wood. Not painted, nothing. It's sick. Also, this town for 11 months of the year has a population of about 700 people, mostly just locals. One month of the year, December, from early December to just after Christmas, which is now, it's about December the 8th now, um, the population goes up to three and a half thousand. And like I said, it's full of celebrities and world leaders and all stuff, and they all verge on here. 
at this time. So we might just bump into Tom Cruise or George Clooney. Hey, there's Brad Pitt, bro. Let's go. What are you doing here, Brad Pitt, bro? Don't come here. Give you uppercut, man. It's not him, bro. It's just the wannabe Brad Pitt. The whole place smells like, like wood, like beautiful wood, like chopped wood, like a like a beautiful high quality furniture store. Wow, bro. Look at this. And they got like a like a like sort of like a monorail thing that goes through it. Wow, bro. Let's go up this way. This seems to be uh, one of, like a main shopping street. You know what? I'm starving. I'm glad that I'm glad I get to eat here. I wonder how expensive the food's gonna be. Tell me that's not the best look in Dolce and Gabbana store you ever seen. Wow, look inside it, bro. That's crazy. That's beautiful. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm putting my body cam on so I can go and film in every store and I don't have to be shifty about it. There we go. Let's go in here. How much are these? The whole one is a bit more than the others, but 109 francs. Wow, just like average 150? The yeah, one is 129. Oh, 120? Alright, sweet. Yes. Yeah, nice, nice. That's mad. All Swiss army knives and tobacco. <laughs> that must be the thing up here, eh? Smoke cigars and like stab trees. <laughs> Man, it's this little church. Switzerland has the maddest churches. Little, really humble, but beautiful churches. They got food in here. I might go in here and get a feed. They had like normal food, nachos, fish and chips. Let's go in, lad. Hello. Hello. Yeah, for lunch, please. Can I sit outside? Yeah, thank you. Right, it's so hot in here. Like, look, all right, it's snowing outside. But when you come into these places, it's like 40 degrees. It's so hot, bro. All right, what do we get? Oh, California club sandwich, that's what we need, brother. California club sandwich and a banoffee pie. Yes, lad. A California club sandwich, chicken, bacon, cheese, tomato, lettuce, mayonnaise. 26 francs and a banoffee pie, 15 francs. Let's cut. They brought the dessert first, lad. I'm not gonna lie about that. Am I upset about that? No, I'm not, cuz. I'm not gonna lie about that either, but I'm starving. What are you talking about, cuz? If you think I'm gonna sit here and do food reviews as well, I'm not. I'm just gonna smash it, lad. Any reviews start, bro. No banoffee pies, alright? Get the fuck out of here. I'm starving, lad, but that's crack. All right, feed done. Energy to move on. You just want to know what the feed's about? Buy a club sandwich yourself, mate. I don't do food reviews. I do Gustav reviews, mate. I do billionaire reviews. I take for leaps. Rollies. My wife wants a Rolex, but. Every time I go buy one, they keep saying you gotta put your name down and we'll send you an invitation one day and one day we'll get a... We'll see, if I can buy one, I'll buy one, but if not, you just can go fuck yourselves. They make it difficult, mate. You know what they do? 
They pretend that it, like, it's just the whole act to try to act like it's prestige, mate. You got 600 million sitting in your factory. Just sell it to the people that want it. I'm asking them. Oh, it's closed. All right. I'm not asking them nothing. <laughs> you save that for another day, wife. Sorry about that. I don't know how to say that brand, mate. Hermes. I'm an Aussie, so that's called Hermes, right? <laughs> but I know it's called like Herme or Herma. 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 Ah, this is sick, bro. All jokes aside, sorry about the comedy show, but like the sugar kicked in from the Bonoffi pie, right? So it's either I do comedy or I snap kick someone. World's bougiest Ralph Lauren store, mate. We're going in. Hidden camera is on. Good, thank you. I wish my wife would like Ralph Lauren bags. They're not Christian Dior and Louis fucking Vuitton. That's a game jacket, lad. Men's bags? Is it just that bag there? We have more downstairs. Whoops. Sorry about that. That's mad in there. You want to know the funniest question? Are you looking for something special? <laughs> yeah, well, fuck, I hope it's fucking special, mate. <laughs> I'm looking for something subordinary. Nice Prada store, bro. We'll have a little gaze in the Prada store, eh? Have a gaze in. Oh, there's that palace. There it is. Eh? We'll get to it. I want to go under that palace. Also, I want to walk in front of the world's most expensive school. This is craziness. Let's have a look in Prada. Hello. Hey, how are you? Welcome to yourself. Backpack or uh... Well, this is actually close to what I'm looking for. Okay. It's close, like close. Okay. Can I see it? Yeah, can I see it? Of course. Let me handle that. It's adjustable, so you can open a bit more, yeah. and it's cross. It goes across. Yes. And it would sit on the front of you. Can it also sit on the back of you? Sure, of yeah, course. Yeah. You can either put it in the front or in the back. And it's nylon, so it's really light yeah. and also resistant has quite a lot of space and you also oh, yeah. have an inside pocket and you also have here a side pocket where nice. you can put and a little pocket here too. Exactly. So it's like a sportive day to day bag. I like this. Yeah, it's I like very that. nice. What's the price of that? It's 1910. 1910. Franks. Swiss francs, yes. Swiss francs, yeah. I'll consider that. I'm looking around. That's very close to exactly what I want. Okay. What I want. Well, it's a easy shape and a yeah. very practical, like even if you would like to do sports or just go travel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Traveling. All right, thank you. You're welcome. Enjoy your walk. Yeah. <laughs> See you soon. See ya. Bye. 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 It's a gun store. I'm not paying one. Th Ooh, almost died for the fifth time. Another 1,900 francs for a nylon bag. Go snap kick yourself in the head. Go knee yourself in the face. Give yourself an uppercut. <laughs> I don't mind paying that if the bag's like leather or something. I'll buy my missus handbags for that. A nylon bag. Cars, relax. It's worth $5. 1,900 francs. Wake up to yourself. Rip the billionaires off, brother. <laughs>
That's like, what's that? Uh, nearly four grand, three and a half grand. these lodges in the back streets wow man look at this can i walk it <laughs> probably not there's a train track what all right that was a mistake my shoes are wet now i can hear water lad look at that Heck That's sick. That would be the cleanest water. I remember in Interlaken. And Interlaken isn't even as high up in the snow as this. And the water was... Um, I was drinking it. I was swimming in it. I was uh, baptizing myself in that cars. How was that even there? What happened then? What a cracker shot, bro. My favorite car, my favorite water, under the lodge of the lodges. That's gonna be a photo on my Instagram. <laughs> Go on my Insta and look back like a month, it'll be there. Let's suss out these wrecks here. Someone's got a mad STI here. Stop. Wow. Lad, that's a beast. Mark. Gustart, that's gangster, mate. He's got like a Gustart badge on his STI, lad. He'll chase. Let's go suss out where this school is. Let me see the world's most expensive school. We've got to see this, mate. We've got to see this. Even if we can't get past the <laughs> security electric fences, we still got to see it. It's through here, through the Moncler and Prada store. Lad, wow, that's off its head. This is fairy tale stuff, bro. This is fairy tale stuff. Oh, what? Do you think this was like, that's like rock hard. Ugh. That's a big chunk of ice. I thought it was fluffy snow. I was gonna knock off. I'll tell you something. I feel, I, feel, I don't know why I'm puffed down. But the altitude, I was gonna say. Bro, that's the school. That is La Rose College, the world's most expensive school. Sometimes the world's second most expensive school. Have a go at it. It's a boarding school. Like I said earlier, 140,000 francs a year to go here, about a quarter of a million dollars. Sort of. All right, the thing I'm gonna do break in is, bro, relax. I don't wanna steal your MacBook Pros. I'm just doing a YouTube video, mate. Oh. Bro, oh, my spot again! Sorry. Guten Tag. Doesn't really stand out as a school, does it? Looks pretty much just like every other building we walk past. It's really interesting, bro. Like, regardless whether it's first or second most expensive in the world, it's quarter of a million dollars a year to go there. Let's calculate there. Let's calculate that to do your high school there. Six years, one and a half million. One and a half million dollars, just high school, brother. What are you talking about? Cause it's only not, that's only high school. These streets are ridiculous. What is this place, man?
All right, we have a sauce in the Louis. Hello. Hello, sir. Welcome. Hey. Have you got men's bags? Sort of like a front bag. Somewhere halfway between a backpack and. Can I see that? Oh, yeah. How much are these? It's 1,860. 1860 francs? Yes. Yeah. This one is like this. How much is this one? It's oh, 2,430. 2,200 francs. And women's bags too. Can I say women's bags too? Yeah. Like a, a, a black, black woman's bag. Is there color variations of this? So uh, it's existing. With the classic monogram, like in brown, yep. it exists in two colors, in full black as well. It exists like this in full black? Yeah. And what is the strap? Is it a chain? Is it... No, it's a leather one. Leather strap. It's like this. Can I say the black please? The black, I yep. don't have it. Oh, you don't have it here? No. But it's the same like this one, yep. only in big size. What, what other color is there, can I see, that you have? Yep, yeah. this one is all brown. The classic. I think I'll buy this one. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Beautiful. Thank you, mate. Thank you so much, sir. All right, thank you, bye. Have a wonderful day. You too. That's the one she'll like, eh? Oi. Bro, I keep nearly dying, lad. You'll chay. Oh, Christmas bag, lad. 2,400 francs. Hey, mate, hey, mate. Oh, fine, mate, mate, mate. Yeah. <laughs> you know what, but I'm not gonna lie. It's pretty empty. But then again, it's not, it's not quite Christmas. Around just before Christmas, after Christmas, around them holidays, it'll probably be pumping. We're still like early to mid uh, December. Yeah, I don't mind paying like four grand or something, but not me. I'm not gonna pay f f whatever that stupid Prada bag was. For me, I'm a man, do you know what I mean? I'd rather buy valuable stuff, <laughs> not bags. This is. This is their little thing. That's pretty much the whack. That's gist, that's start. I've been pronouncing it wrong the whole time. Just start. It's, it's just pronounced start. But that's start in, in a nutshell. School, the famous motel, the strips of shops. That's it, man. My place, it's my place. Back to the train station, back to Geneva. Hooroo start, goodbye. <laughs>